The rarely seen fatal five-way match is now underway. They say three's a crowd, but the fifth wheel in this match is so off the wild card. It just adds that extra element of unpredictability that makes this match so thrilling. He's turning the tables. He's been placed in the corner now. Torturous focus on the leg. Oof. Pain must be shooting through that leg now. All the way up. Sidewalk slam delivered. Attempt. Meanwhile, here's Drew McIntyre. Back suplex. Talk about cocky, glory after placing the knee on the back of the neck. As easy as it may seem to come into a no DQ match with no plan other than to get violent, strategy can play a role in this. Now's the time for a superstar to get inventive, to get creative when it comes to inflicting damage on their opponents. It wasn't the higher distance that caused the damage, but they certainly contributed. Check your face after that. Right on the arm. Sent hard to the outside. Superstar picking up speed. Ah, oh, reversal catches Booker T. Sharp elbows to the body. They're going to fight his way out. Set up for the side rush and leg sweep. And Booker without the energy to prevent that. Yeah, that right there was Knight's smash mouth style we always talk about. You might be in shock now, but you'll be feeling lasting pain for a few weeks to come. Able to reverse the board. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. STO! Incoming! Great crash landing! Powerball! Picture yeah. perfect example for when you just want to put someone down. Match. 
Solely focused on in a corner. Oh! Now back to the Scottish Warrior. Oh, look at the scoop slam. Style going down low. Are you kidding me? Superstar has a hold of the leg going round and round and a leg breaker. Looking for the back suplex. No. Completely out of it. 
But now here's Knight. Wow, what an arm drag. AJ Styles rolls through. Here it comes. Cap Crusher is a play. Danny Hager, he gets there. A few seconds longer in this match would have been over. the arm. Now in control. Fighting back, however, punches in the midsection. He got whipped into that corner. Can't believe it. From behind. Six up. Drops the hammer. Good. Booker off the ropes. Booker T has this wrapped up. Oh, he breaks up the pin. We got a little tandem offense in our future. How about is rocking the WWE Universe making their feelings known. Oh, there it is! Booker T with the bookend! Will that close things for Booker? Oh, I heard a snap! Ow, Axel! Pop! Elbow drop! Piercing. of everyone in the WWE Universe. I think they've noticed, Byron. Very rarely do we see someone the size of Damian Priest possess the amount of speed and agility that he does. That's why you always have to be on your toes when you're in the ring with him. There's no telling when he'll unleash that speed with a well-placed strike. Certainly a perilous situation to find yourself in when you face off against Damian Priest. And then we have Jey Uso, an extremely talented in-ring competitor who accomplished great things with his family by his side. But Jey doesn't need any backup to get the win. He can do it all by himself. Jey actually prefers to do things on his terms, to be in the driver's seat. He's ready to make a statement here that Jey Uso is a certified threat with or without someone by his side. Elbow drop. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Headbutt! <laughs> He's absorbed some damage already. Jay's confidence really showed in that maneuver. 
Over the last few years, main event Jey Uso has really come into his own as a solo competitor, wouldn't you say? I agree wholeheartedly, Cole, but his best work is still done alongside his brother. Jay has a lot of tag team tendencies that don't fade very easily, so it's important to keep him overwhelmed. Uh-oh. He deflects it right back. Just breaking down the opponent. So much damage inflicted. Caught with the elbow. Suicide dive. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Oh, he's looking to completely render this leg useless. Stump puller leg snap. Very effective. Lots of potential for injury here at ringside. These superstars better be careful. The floor, the barricades, our table. None of these things are fun to collide with. A main event display from main event J. Jay letting the aggression flow, and it's doing him wonders. And we know for a fact that this is just not some casual matchup. Guys, this rivalry has seemingly reached critical mass. Well, I'd actually say it could be worse, Cole, but it's definitely not great as it is. The lack of respect these superstars have for each other is astounding to watch. They hate each other, simply put. And who knows what it will take for them to actually resolve their issues. For the pin and the win! Yes! life a long two and a half in the waning moments of this match boom priest is having problems here uso is determined right now oh man right to the arm hyper extend your elbow a flat out power into the scoop slam top rope uso splashed by jay did that finish priest off He's still in this fight. Damian Priest rising from the brink with a hell of a kick out. Main event, Jey Uso with a close call right there. He definitely thought he had that one in the bag. Whoa, springboard attack. Bam! Down he goes. unique superstar we've ever seen. Constantly evolving, constantly creating. Each version of Wyatt is more impressive and dangerous than the last. And crucially, the WWE Universe continues to follow him wherever he goes. Yeah, and Kane said his opponent has forgotten who WWE's true monster is. And he'll remind him by doing the devil's work. When you stand across the ring from Kane, you are getting a frightening glimpse of hell on earth. Nice cross body. Isolating their opponent's arm and oh! Oh, stop right to the hand. You gotta wonder if there's more animosity in this match than we previously thought. That was one big behemoth flying down with authority and force. The stomp in every single part of his body. Taking it outside the ring now. Uh-oh. Elbow drop. 
And we might be about to go from commentators to participants in this one, fellas. Bray Wyatt loves to play mind games both before and during his matches. With that in mind, Corey, how exactly do you approach a match against Wyatt? Well, it's easier said than done, Cole, but you can't allow Wyatt to get inside your head. You can't let the mind games work on you, because the second that they do, then you've already lost. Whip right into the barricade. Elbow drop on target. Oh, Kane waylays him. And he tosses him back in now. He's testing fate here in danger of a count out. And what we've got here isn't necessarily legal, but it's incredibly effective. And clearly stooping low with that attack. And there is no other term for that than just cheap, a cheap shot. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. There he goes, right into the corner. What a counter. The devil's favorite demon with the devil's favorite sidewalk slam. Pure, unadulterated sadism at the hands of Kane. The destruction of the body is just about complete. This is where Kane fe Can he do it here? And still hanging on. At this point in the match, that could have gone either way. This could be big. Going up high. And a menacing look from Kane. <laughs> Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Looking for more damage here. Ah, release back suplex. Not the prettiest thing you'll ever see, but it sure looks effective from here. Thrown back in under the ropes. being deprived of his true joy of punishment there. No respect being shown whatsoever. The big red monster. Kane lifts him up. Got him set for the... Tombstone! And Bray finds himself in trouble. And he's managed not to let Bray Wyatt's mind games play a major part in this match. With his mind clear, he's been able to get the upper hand. And a series of vicious stomps. Oh, directly to the body. Shoulders down! Shoulders up before two. I don't know what more this superstar can do to put him away. Ah, claw to the face. Ripping at the eyes. Getting carried around. Bad spot to be in. Oh, he can end it here. He's got him. A kick out at two. This is going to come down to who wants it more. And Wyatt falls to a counter. Oh, flipping the script on him there. The sleeper hold is cinched in. Time to go night night. Sleeper. He doesn't have long to get out of this sleeper hold, but he's figuring it out. Whoa. Short clothesline hits its mark. The devil's favorite demon with the devil's favorite sidewalk slam. The big red monster sizing him up. A ring of pride. Top wrist lock, opponent down to one knee. Now starts to fight out with some punch. Oh, there it is. The man of a claw, it's locked in. 
Will Wyatt end it here? That's got to be it. The rope stopped the pin. And Wyatt telling the crowd to watch him. This is a testament to the sheer fortitude it takes to compete at this high level. No one bending, no one breaking. This has been an intense matchup. Big boot. Bray scales all the way up top. Diving save time. Wow, that was amazing. of victory for this young man. It was certainly a treat for all of us to watch here tonight. This superstar can now enjoy his victory. Oh, what the hell is he doing? Oh, no, yeah. not the steel chair. Come on. Oh, oh my God. Him. This is absolutely heinous. Totally uncalled for. He's out of control. The ninth wonder of the world, China, is one of the most dominant superstars the WWE has ever seen. It's hard to imagine where the women's division would be without China kicking down the doors. Penny predicament, shoulders down, and she kicks out. Already having to expel so much unnecessary energy this early on. She's pushed into the corner. Boom, right to the midsection. And some effective offense with that one. Uh-oh, uh-oh. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. And now she's looking to go top rope. From the top! Oh, she lands hard. Oh my goodness! Ah, what a smash! That is just insulting. Denied via a wicked punch to the stomach. Dumps her to the outside. Look out! Incredible! That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. Delivering nasty stumps. Putting the boots to an opponent will take the fight out of them in a hurry. Oh, just in case the first few didn't hurt, there's another. China's dominance is sure to be on full display in this match, right, Corey? Oh, yeah. China doesn't know any other mode. It's going to be a lot of seek and destroy. No woman can match her in that regard. Ooh, what a forearm club. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. Can she do it here? She breaks the count quick. A little closer to getting the pinfall there, but this is still anybody's fight. Tremendous pressure being applied in this head crank. Might take her head clean off her shoulders. Ah, oh, China with a military press. Look at the power. <laughs> Just disturbing power. Dominance. Knee drops. That was nasty. So precise. She's getting fired up, ready to show her opponent what she's got. And Rhea with reason to question her confidence after that attack. Yeah, very motivated China in front of us. Oh, strong knee connects. Rhea Ripley in a state of distress. Yeah, there is no safe corner for Rhea and China in the ring. And shoulders are down. Oh, somehow. She likely knew that wasn't enough. She's just keeping the pressure on. Long fall and even harder impact. I don't care how much padding the floor seems to have. Being thrown out of the ring like that is incredibly unforgiving to your body. Oh, man. Yeah, that's how we do it. 
Showing out their deadlifting prowess and just... Second, this superstar looking for a reprieve on the outside. But that reprieve is not going to last very long. Oh, look at that. Should have stayed in the ring. Got them right where they want them. Yeah, that was a dirty and cowardly trick. Whatever it takes to get an advantage, Saxton. She heads into the ring. this to words anymore and are dead set on taking action. Well, there are only so many words you can use to settle a feud like this, Saxton. Ooh, 
leg snap. Oh, the torque on the knee. Ooh, right to the midsection. And now she's climbing to the top turnbuckle. Soaring. Oh, my! Ah, oh, she counters right back on China. Oh, look at his aggression in the corner. Yeah, on the throat in the corner. Forks the move by throwing an elbow into the midsection. China looking for the double underhook. Here it comes. down here. Can't put this one away even after that big maneuver. Sight set on the top rope. You can see her struggling to find her bearings. Got out of that position with the desperation jawbreaker. Both of these women have been scratching and clawing to be the first one up the proverbial mountaintop. It's almost unfair that only one of these women will get the victory, but at least they'll both get the glory. The noise surging through this arena is ridiculous. It's the echoes of the universe witnessing a war. So ruthless. Turns it around, sole the foot meet. Kick to the gut. Here it comes, Leah with the riptide. Ripley with an emphatic statement. The cover! Picked up the victory! Here is your winner, Hurrah Ripley! Despite less than legal efforts to defeat them, they are standing tall now coming back after being on the receiving end of an underhanded attack and winning it all? Impressive doesn't even begin to describe it. Some might say lucky does, though.